Dear all, welcome to the playlist of Power Electronics. In this session, I will be discussing about the difference between N-channel and P-channel MOSFETs. Moving on to the session. In case of N-channel MOSFET, N-channel MOSFETs are electron flow as the charge carrier, where in case of P-channel MOSFET, hole is a charge carrier actually. Regarding N-channel MOSFET, it offers very less resistance as compared to P-channel MOSFETs. Because of that, the losses will be very much high in case of P-channel MOSFET, where losses are less in case of N-channel MOSFET. Because of reduced losses, N-channel MOSFET offers high efficiency. And also if I talk about opposite side, P-channel MOSFET shows less efficient. Regarding the heat generation, in case of N-channel MOSFET, very less heat will be generated. But in the case of uh, P-channel MOSFET, high amount of heat will be generated. Regarding the grounding, I would like to say you, it's standard practice to have a common ground between connected devices and modules. You can easily have that with the help of N-channel MOSFET. So grounding issue will not be occurring in case of N-channel MOSFET. But if I talk about on the opposite hand, it need to create a common VCC instead of a common ground. That is an issue regarding P-channel MOSFET. If I talk about the size, N-channel MOSFET occupies very lesser area, where P-channel MOSFET occupies higher area. For the similar size, P-channel MOSFET occupies larger area. That is another uh, setback regarding P-channel MOSFET. If I talk about RDS, on-state resistance drop, RDS, RDS is very less in case of N-channel MOSFET, where P-channel MOSFET shows high RDS. While doing the design, RDS is very important. Then, if I speak about N-channel MOSFET, high switching device, mobility is based on electron flow actually. Electron is the carrier. But in case of P-channel MOSFET, regarding the speed of operation, that is very less compared to N-channel MOSFET. Because uh, hole is the charge carrier, mobility of hole is uh, very low, you know. Then, uh, if I compare about N-channel MOSFET, MOSFET and P-channel MOSFET regarding the size and complexity, Smaller in size for same complexity, but in case of P-channel MOSFET, size will be bulkier. Then regarding the turning on and turning off peculiarities, an N-channel MOSFET turn on when you apply a positive voltage at the gate terminal. Anyway, you know MOSFET is a voltage control device. Sufficient amount of gate impulse have to be uh, passed to the particular gating terminal. Then only MOSFET will on. So in case of N-channel MOSFET, you need to apply the positive gate pulse, where negative gate pulse need to be given for turning on of uh, P-channel MOSFET. Then the circuit symbol for N-channel MOSFET has an arrow pointing towards the device gate. That's a speciality that I will be showing you. If I speak about P-channel MOSFET, the circuit diagram symbol for a P-channel MOSFET has an arrowing point away from the gate. That I will show you just now. So I have taken a separate diagram for you. So you can able to identify the P-channel MOSFET and N-channel MOSFET by looking at the symbol. One is towards, other will be, uh, one is away, other one is towards. So that's a speciality. Let me show you the diagram. If I talk about N-channel MOSFET, you can see the direction. It will be towards the gate. Okay. If I speak about P-channel, the direction that will be away from the gate. Okay. That's a speciality. Similarly, some practical example I would like to tell you regarding N-channel MOSFET. IR of 630, then IR of P250, and these are the popular N-channel MOSFET. You will be getting more information with the help of data sheet. You can download the data sheet. Then regarding P-channel MOSFET, IR of uh, 9Z34NS. If you click on it, you will be getting more information. And, and also IR of 4905S. These are the popular examples of P-channel MOSFET. In this session, I have discussed about the major comparison between N-channel MOSFET and P-channel MOSFET. In, I would like to tell you the conclusion. So based on the advantageous features of N-channel MOSFET, so N-channel MOSFETs are most commonly used MOSFET compared to P-channel MOSFET. So it is quite popular. Whenever you are doing a project, mostly you will be choosing N-channel MOSFET only because of its convenience and popularity. And also it is more cost effective compared to P-channel MOSFET. So because of this uh, consideration, we are going to choose N-channel MOSFET for your work or your, for your project. Rare cases, we will be using P-channel MOSFET. There are, there are certain applications. Okay. Finally, thank you very much for watching this video.